Okay, so right now I want to show you how to um, navigate your way around Illustrator a bit more quickly and easily with a few um, shortcuts and just some of the, the things that you need to know. So the last document we worked on, some junk left here. You can get rid of it all quickly by going Control A and delete, or alternatively, you could drag a marquee using your black arrow, your selection tool, and then press delete. Okay, both has the same effect. When I want to uh, move around my document and look at something more closely or zoom out and see the whole thing, the way that I do that is using the control and scroll options. So if I hold the con I'll just draw something first so you can see the benefit of this. So I'm drawing uh, this time a couple of circles, a big one and a little one and a really little one. And if I wanted to zoom in on this one particularly and work on it without having to see the rest, I would hold my mouse over the object and control scroll to go side to side, alt scroll to zoom in and out. Okay, so a simple scroll on the uh, scroll wheel on your mouse will take you up and down. Alt scroll, zoom in and out, and control scroll, zoom side to side, or pan side to side. Okay, so that's really helpful. Uh, if I wanted to quickly uh, view my document at a certain percentage, down the bottom left you can see uh, different options. Probably one of the most useful ones is fit on screen. Then I can see the whole document on the screen at once. Um, you can use the little dragging slider things there, but they can be quite tricky to control um, and not as fast as using one hand on Alt and Control and the other hand on your mouse wheel. So that's some navigating techniques. If I had multiple artboards, and I'll just make a couple of new ones now. This is the artboard tool over here. And I want to add a couple of artboards. I can just click on the little new artboard button and it automatically makes me a new one. Which I can line up with the green guides. That's artboard number two. I might make another one. Artboard number three. Notice that it makes the artboard at the same size. I could custom make the artboard just by clicking and dragging. Which can sometimes be helpful. So you can see I've got five artboards now. If I wanted to quickly jump to one of these artboards, down the bottom there is an option, artboard navigation. I can go to artboard one, or artboard five, or whichever artboard I want to work on. Also, I can alt scroll and control scroll to navigate my way around. That'll do.